Now, what if we have a function that is some base to the exponent negative x? Is that increasing or decreasing? We just have to remember that this negative x means reciprocal, and so essentially functions that look like this, y equals one half to the exponent negative x are the same as y equals two to the exponent x. And so a function that looks like this is equivalent to a function that looks like this. And so this function is going to be increasing as we move from left through to right. In other words, increasing throughout its domain. If on the other hand, we have a function that looks like this, y equals three halves to the exponent negative x. In this case, you will notice that the base is greater than one and this is a negative x, and so that means take the reciprocal. So this is essentially equivalent to y equals two thirds to the exponent x. And so this function, because the base is actually between zero and one, is going to be decreasing throughout its domain. And so the reciprocal property actually tells us what happens relative to the increasing and decreasing nature of the function.